Hello, Michelle. So, friends, we're here from Pageant Bag Philippines. And first off, congratulations to um, for making to the official candidate of Miss Grand Philippines. How does it feel once again? Oh my gosh, it feels so surreal that I'm finally here right now. If only you know how long I've been preparing for this. I've been very vocal about me wanting to join since Beanie Beanie 2021 last year. And now that ALB has attained the franchise, I feel like this is my time. And with all the experience that I've had in pageantry, I really feel like Kaya. Wow. So is there any pressure or do you feel any pressure that um, uh, on your journey right now, because the previous um, pageant you've joined, actually, which is the international pageant, you won, uh, at least you placed first runner-up. So is there, any is there any feeling of pressure to you right now? Remember, Naman, there's always feelings of pressure because sometimes, like, there's high expectations for things. And, of course, it's Miss Grand, so mm -hmm. the expectations are through the roof but bar, yeah. I know I have to work really hard for this mm -hmm. and really show everyone that I have the determination I have the work ethic to really mm -hmm. persevere through this entire journey but it's really it's a human experience to mm -hmm. feel these kinds of things like the jitters and the anxiety so at least that will be it ignites a fire in, within me in what particular of the journey or preparation that you are actually most challenged about? Passarella. Oh. I mean, I've, I wouldn't say it's my weakness, mm -hmm. but I wouldn't... It's, it's like a dance. Some people can dance better than others. Some people can sing better than others. But I really... Oh my God, Shakira, these hips do lie. So I've really <laughs> had to work on it mm -hmm. and... I've just had to put more time and effort with this, but I know everything will pay off in the end because I'm I have something in store for you guys. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So, um, if you're going to rate your chances of winning this uh, pageant, oh uh, how would you rate yourself being ten the highest? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'd say with my preparations, mm -hmm. I'm like. 8.7 mm -hmm. but of course there's always that small window of doubt like if I can if I can do it or not and I have mm -hmm. really strong competitors with me mm -hmm. and they're all deserving mm -hmm. and of course we never know at the end of the day what the judges want mm -hmm. and there's always room for improvement so exactly. if ever they don't find me fit for the mm -hmm. crown I know I can always try again but mm -hmm. I'm ready for it. I oh, uh, break the stereotypes. Who says I'm not the prototype? I can mm -hmm. be the prototype. That's right. And uh, you mentioned a while ago self-doubt earlier. Mm -hmm. How do you handle that? I'm thankful I have such a, a strong support system like mm -hmm. my friends and family that I can reach out to. Mm -hmm. And also I have a little kitty cat that helps me with my anxiety uh -huh. so whenever I'm feeling like anxious about anything when I'm in my safe space at home mm -hmm. that's what gets me through it and at uh -huh. least I have the right encouragement from the people that mm -hmm. I surround myself with that mm -hmm. I can do this all right could you introduce yourself now my name is Michelle Arceo I am 25 years old and I will be representing Quezon City Thank you so much, Michelle, and I'm so glad to see you again. Audio jungle.